Hi gorgeous souls, welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for dropping by. Coming in here with another flow on message I feel from this entire past probably four to five days and um, I've posted them obviously as I've been led and I've posted them in the order that I was led and these two that came out today, walking away and it was clarified with Archangel Michael, right, with the root chakra. Some of you out there have been asking about chakras and things, and I will possibly get into that in the next couple of weeks with you. Um, but coming back to this message, beautiful souls, walking away. Now, fellas, take this as it resonates. Obviously, it's a female in this picture, but obviously, you know, if you're a man and this is resonating with you, it's he or she. It's just the energy. Um she is walking out and walking away. She's literally about to close the gate, close the door are the words they're giving me on, on what I'm feeling is an old chapter of your life, you know, an old relationship, an old workspace, um, old friendship circles, etc. And sh she is being divinely led, right? This person's being divinely led. You can see the orbs of light, around her in front of her guiding the way now we can't see what she's walking into it's quite misty out there like there's not really anything um to see so maybe you know this is a brand new well this is a brand new season for a lot of us out there at this time and we are trusting god and the angels to bring us through and to take us where we are meant to be and i feel heavily this is why archangel michael has come out as well so both of them signifying red Maybe you're wearing a lot of red at this time. Red is a power color, obviously. Red, so the root chakra is all about stability, security. It's all about, you know, our groundedness in our lives and in our internal state of being. Maybe you've been outside in nature lately. Maybe you've been spending more time, um, you know, focusing on um, securing yourself and stabilizing yourself for this new season, whatever that is. And so I'm going to go to um, the walking away card first. Um, I'm heavily feeling, obviously, this is linked in with some of my other messages, but letting go and moving on. This card shows someone walking away from an existing situation. She's closing the gate behind her and is walking away into a misty, unknown future. This card upright reveals that it could be time for you to make a similar decision. Now, remember what I said, for many of us in this season, we are going to be moved. We may have already started. You know, a lot of us may have already been presented with work opportunities or you know um, that there's work opportunities coming in for you. You're wanting to change careers. Um, for some of you, you know, you may have already left and you've kind of been in that, um, you know, void kind of state. You've just kind of been in limbo. They're saying you're waiting for this other opportunity, but you've literally closed the door on this last season. And for many of us, these things are going to start to appear for us in the month of July. It's very significant. Um, and so it's saying there may be something that you're finished with, perhaps a career, a goal, a relationship, or a long-term experience of some kind. The familiarity of this situation may be enticing, Maybe with your old job, for example, it paid really well. It was just easy to do. You'd done it for so long. You could have done it with your eyes closed, whatever that is for you. But now it's no longer fulfilling to you. Maybe the workspace has started to become toxic. Um, maybe you've been let go, they also said, you know, shutting the gate behind her. Um, take it as it resonates. But now is the new season. And for many of us, particularly with work and careers and our passions, we are going to be redirected to what our soul needs now. You know, we're moving into our soul aligned um, purpose here on earth for many of us, or you're moving into the next step that is going to get you to where you need to be. You know, we're always learning, right? We're always learning and growing. Um, this card 
uh, sorry, in reality, an important new beginning is at hand. Exactly. You've got to shut the door on one before the new door opens. And I've literally just done a swag of videos on um, keys and locks and doors and all of those kinds of things. This card also indicates that now would be a good time to let go of an old habit, emotional pattern or false belief. Now, remember, we can't take the old way of thinking, our old programming and that with us into this brand new season. Well, spirit for a start, they, your guides and angels won't let you. You'll keep rotating and stagnating until you actually release whatever it is that needs to be let go of. No matter how deeply ingrained a negative pattern may be, you now have the power to release it and move on to freer, healthier ways of thinking and relating to yourself and others. Whether it's in the inner or outer world, this card is telling you that you have the readiness and resources to walk away from the old and move forward into the new. And the little affirmation, I like giving these out, beautiful souls, and I will put them in the description box below. It is safe and comfortable for me to move on. I consider all of my options and then take action on my own behalf. Now, take action has literally come out in at least three or four of my previous videos. And um, I highly suggest, as I said, for you to go back and check them out because it's all about action. God, your angels, your guides, your ancestors, you know, the spirit team cannot, they cannot do the physical work. You have to do that. They can lead you and guide you in the right direction, but you must be the one that physically takes the step. So stability and security, right? Because this new season is going to move you, even if it doesn't feel like it right now, beautiful souls, into a grounded peaceful stable secure environment and you know it might be a little bit um not topsy-turvy it might be a little bit weird or uncomfortable at the start because you're moving into something brand new you've never done it before this is for this group of people um, Archangel Michael holds a beautiful globe of red energy at his first base chakra, which is located at the base of the spine. Maybe you've been working on your chakras at this time. Maybe you've been doing a lot of clearing. This is the place where your sense of stability and security is stored. When this card is upright, it reveals that your energy is flowing freely regarding these issues. Even if you've had problems with feeling insecure in the past, these challenges are beginning to be resolved at this time. And the more you move forward and into your purpose, the more grounded and stable and secure you will feel and become. Archangel Michael is with you, bringing you strength and personal stability. You are capable of taking action and moving forward on your path. So allow yourself to feel increasing faith in your own power and security now and always. And again, you are capable of taking action. I swear, as I said before, there's been three or four videos where it's been all about action. But you must take, you must take the first step, beautiful souls. Spirit's got your back. They're taking you in the right direction. You've got to let go. You've got to shut these doors and gates and, you know, um, old belief patterns and thoughts and feelings and emotions. You've just got to let them go. And it may feel, as I said, a little bit scary at the start, but you are going in the right direction, right? So beautiful souls, if that has landed with you, hit the little thumbs up button below, first time viewers. If that has resonated, hit the little notifications bell. I would love to see you here in my community. Subscribe to my channel. Otherwise, I'm sending you all so many blessings and I will see you in here for the next one. Bye for now.